To access the drive shaft flex disc, you will have to remove the exhaust system and the exhaust heat shield. Please see the link at the end of this video for additional assistance with those projects. When replacing the discs, at a minimum, replace the self-locking nuts that attach the drive shaft to the flex disc. I prefer to replace the bolts too. The drive shaft flex disc is also referred to as the guibo. Raise and support the rear of the vehicle on jack stands. If you have an all-wheel drive BMW E90, remove the complete exhaust system. Then remove the center heat shield that runs along the drive shaft tunnel. Working at the transmission, remove the three 18 mm drive shaft flex disc fasteners, as indicated by the green arrows. Using a pry bar or a large flathead screwdriver, lever the drive shaft away from the transmission. Support the drive shaft using rope or mechanics wire. You won't need much force to do this. If it won't move, you may have left a bolt in place. Next, working at the transmission flange side, remove the three drive shaft flex disc mount fasteners, green arrows. Be sure to replace the nuts for the flex disc. They are self-locking and should not be reused. Install the new drive shaft flex disc onto the drive shaft and install the fasteners finger tight. The arrows on the flex disc should point towards the flange. Then install the drive shaft flex disc to the transmission and tighten the fasteners. Then tighten the drive shaft flex disc to drive shaft fasteners. Finally, install any items you have removed to improve access. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.